sound and visuals from any concert or conference really make or break the audience experience. Let's meet the person responsible for making sure you hear and see everything, even from the back of the room, an audio video technician. Hi, Brian. John. Nice to meet you. Yeah, you as well. You uh, want to show me around? Absolutely. Great. I'm John Russell, and I'm an audio video technician in Prince George, BC. An audio video technician is someone who operates, installs, and tears down lighting, video equipment, audio equipment. We transform spaces into uh, complete event packages and take it all away in the span of 24 hours. So a specific task for us, say uh, in a conference situation, is we get there with the truck of gear, we unload, and then we set up speakers for audio reinforcement, we set up screens for image magnification, and then we set up our control area where we basically mix the audio from, switch the video from. So there is a ton of different equipment in here and a huge part of your job is figuring out what is needed for each production. Yes, so in situations where we need a lot of amplified sound, we use something like a line array speaker. It has multiple elements to it and can throw a lot more sound. In a press event or something in a small room, we want a smaller speaker that doesn't produce as much acoustic energy. I've always been interested in audio and I think I was drawn to the fact that it is sporadic, that it is a little different. It's just something that I, I kind of enjoy. There is definitely overtime hours involved. It is not a job where you are nine to five. The hours that we work are after hours, so event hours. Conferences are more nine to five. This is where you bring in all of your audio lines and you have your microphone preamps which amplify those microphones. It's a very flexible output system where you can send it to different speaker systems. These faders control the level of that instrument that is coming in on that channel. You can go to recording school, which is a way to learn audio. You can go to a broadcast engineering school where you can learn video. But I found the best way to learn is on the job. It's really important to be a problem solver in this industry. In some situations, you kind of have to make things up uh, as you go, whether that is restrictions in power consumption or availability, sometimes spaces where you can't put speakers. This industry relies on constant communication. A lot of these spaces we go back to. So the more knowledge you can kind of talk about and have written down really helps with future planning and the more you know about evolving technologies and new technologies, the more hireable you are. The ability now to use a program like Smart, which is something that you can use microphones to let you see what's going on in the room. All of those things, they're educational. Here we've got a projector set up. Tell me about this. So uh, in the situation of a conference, mm -hmm. for instance, we'll typically have a camera at the back of the room and it will be on the podium or the speaker, and it goes into this switcher device. So this switcher has the capability of handling several different inputs. The audio from before and the visual with this, and you're going to be seamlessly putting them together. Absolutely. You'll find this career in so many avenues. You can be a production manager or someone who is maybe a, an engineering head. I think if I could give some advice uh, to young people starting out in this industry, I would say that half of the job is technical, but the other half is service related. So you have to really brush up on your people skills and be prepared to interact with people. The most rewarding aspect is definitely the events that you do. When you do a very large scale event and it goes off flawlessly, there's a feeling inside that, that you all that hard work definitely paid off. John, thank you so much for showing me around today. You're so welcome, Brian. Take care. Yeah, you as well. See ya. Once again, I'm Brian for Career Trek, reminding you that this career could be yours. See you next time.